Good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon. So, shout out to everybody out there. Shout out to all the subscribers. JV, Mr. Spice. Um, you're catching me in rare form. You're catching me in rare action. So, two, two birds with one stone, so to say, right? I have a customer. Shout out to Johnny Utah. I just posted a, a roast con pollo that I do Mr. Spice style. And he wants that, but he wants it with some blackened salmon. So, I said, let me take the time to show the viewers how I get down when I'm doing my food to order. I cook to order and deliver food um, for myself, for my own business and things like that. So if you're in the New York area, Connecticut area, you know, anywhere near the Bronx, Westchester, reach out to me, JV, Mr. Spice, and you know, you, 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 you probably could get down with what I'm doing, but I don't even, promote business like that because I do pretty well for myself so I'm not greedy anyway my cousin Crystal shout out to Crystal um she asked if I'm gonna do a video and why not take the opportunity to do the video so I already have over there on the stove some jasmine white rice that I did this is the salmon for my my amazing customer Johnny Utah shout out to him and I'm just gonna show you how I get down with the Spanish rice Oros con pollo, JV style, with some blackened salmon. Black glove, of course. So I got the salmon just like that, two nice fillets, and I got some Cajun blackened seasoning. I'm just gonna season these real nice, and they're gonna get blackened. And I'm gonna start the process before I start making the rice. The rice is, um, you know, it's rice with peppers and onions and sliced garlic and and chicken and the chicken I'm using is chicken thighs that are already seasoned up and things like that but you know those are not hard things to do but and those are already done but you're gonna see me cook them so anyway I'm on a time constraint so if I'm talking a little fast and I'm and I'm moving a little fast I apologize for that but you know business is business I'm a hustler people what can I say I'm a hustler so check it out sliced garlic Jalapeno, cut up, right? And the salmon is ready. So let's get to the let's get to the stove where I got two pans already ready to go. This is a new pan that I got. It's a um, it's a cast iron skillet, but it has these honeycomb grooves. It's amazing. So that's gonna be that part, and then I'm gonna show you the salmon. So just to show you the salmon, I'll show you the salmon first. So we'll get the oil and then I'll switch them. And then over here, I have a pot, which I'm gonna show you soon with um, the jasmine white rice that I did. So here's the chicken. All I did was it's deboned and sliced and seasoned with some rotisserie seasoning. So that's it, that's all it is. A Little bit of fat on it because the fat is flavor. So. Pan is hot, right? Get some oil. You know I rock with the chili oil. You already know. So boom, chili oil, right? See those red pepper flakes that come out? Can't beat that. Get the oil nice and hot. Very simple. Get those two pieces of salmon, which we already have, and one, and two. Okay, that's for my customer. Very easy. So in the time of me cooking the rice, this is gonna be, you know, and I'll turn it over and blah, blah, blah. All right? Okay, I'll swap. Now, so the pan, hot, oil, right? The amazing thing about this pan is that you could use metal or your silicone and it's amazing. It doesn't scratch or anything and it's very heavy. So just get that like that, get the oil spreaded and we're gonna throw the sliced garlic in there and some onions and then some peppers. About, you know, a handful of each, nothing crazy. So I already showed you the sliced garlic so I'm gonna just throw that in there. Slice garlic. 
chopped onions that I always tell you to keep in your fridge. Chopped onions. All right? It's two orders, so I gotta make it a little generous. So this dish is a little pricey. Salmon and chicken, which I explain to my, my good customer. So, you know, I don't I don't rip people off. I, I give people what they're paying me for. And being that there's no middleman with me, like I'm very generous with my customers. My customers are everything, so that's what I do. That nice. Turn your flame down. Alright, so this pan you don't have to worry about a lot. It, it, it's very, um, it doesn't burn things. It's, the heat is nice. But you can't really go wrong with it. So, boom. Got that, right? That's on low. Got the salmon, a little more when the edges are a little crisper and we'll flip them over. Let that chill. All right. Okay, so now we let this soften a little bit. Now we're gonna add the chicken. Okay, so now here's a little trick. You get a little bit of butter. You don't need to, but this is just me. And this is what I do. I'm just sharing everything that I do. Everything's authentic over here. So, a little piece of butter. Boom. Let that butter melt a little bit. Pepper. Right. I'm telling you, this pan is amazing. If you guys can get this pan, this pan is amazing. Uh, let me see. I think I still, I think I still have. Yeah. So check it out. This is the pan, right? And no, these people, I don't know these people. They don't pay me, whatever. But boom, this is the pan. And you know. It's cast iron, non-stick coating, it's amazing. So there you go, and if you find that, you're, gonna, you're definitely in for the win. All right, so mix this up, like, as you can see, like, look how it's cooking this stuff, this thing is amazing. Anyway, enough about the pan, they don't pay. Me. So, chicken, throw that in there. And we're just gonna let, we're gonna turn the heat up to medium and we're gonna let this all cook. Remember, this is two orders, and you know, this is, this is a little pricey. This is like $20 a dish, so I gotta make it, you know, worth the money. All right, so the salmon, check out the salmon. It's looking good. See, it's not sticking. Boom. Look at that. Amazing. Amazing. Boom. So we let that chill, and... You turn the heat to low, it was on medium, and you just put a cover on that and let that rock. And that's it. So by the time I finish what I'm doing, those will be done. Here's the cover, you just put in the cover, boom. Done. Okay. This now. So another little addition to the spice thing is this little mix right here, which is red pepper flakes and peppercorns, and I'm gonna add some of that a couple times. It's all about flavor, people. It's all about flavor. You don't gotta eat unhealthy to get your flavors and your food to taste good. It's a fact. You just need somebody who knows what they're doing, or you just, you know, follow along and you do it for yourself and you experiment. And your food does not have to be crazy and, you know, Jasmine rice is not is not really that bad for you. It's a better rice. It's a better rice than the regular white rice. And then you can use brown rice if you want. Just you know, it's your preference. But I like the jasmine rice because I like the way it fluffs up when you cook it. All right. So I'm just sauteing this up to a certain point, and then I'm gonna put the rice in there and saute it, and we'll be good. And the salmon is cooking. It's on low. Remember, it was on medium, but it's on low. And by the time this is done, everything is good to go. So, let's see now. I'm 
play around either. Like, when you get stuff from me, you get the good stuff. I don't play around. I'm not, you know. If you know me in person, I am not a cheap individual. And I don't believe in being cheap, so I spread the love. Our chicken is looking good. Chicken is looking good. We're just going to get it a little crisper. And then we're going to add the rice. The rice, which I told you I have on the stove. So let me show you. I'm going to take the cover off. All right, so let me put that right there. And let me show you the rice. Here is the rice. Look at that. Look at that. Ah. What can I say? Down, down deep in the heart, I am a foodie. I'm not a chef either. Like people like to refer to me as a chef. I'm not a chef. I'm a creator. There's a big difference. Chefs follow recipes and thought processes. I don't do that. I don't take away from any chefs out there. Shout out to everybody who you know wants that title. I am not a title chaser, and I am also like to I like to be very unique from other things. So I am a creator. I create things. These are all my own things and recipes, and you know my own ideas and thoughts. So. That's me. I'm not a chef. I'm a creator. Shout out to all the chefs, though. Because without y'all, I wouldn't be where I'm at. So. Okay. See, now the chicken is getting that color we're talking about. And it's nice and soft. And the chicken thighs because they hold in more moisture than the breasts. Um, very popular in Chinese cooking. Like chicken with broccoli and... and um, you know, Asian stir fries and American stir fries. If you use the thighs, it's a it's a moister product at the end of the day, and it's very very universal. So and it, it takes to the high heat cooking very well. So all right, we got our color like how we want, which is that's all we wanted. Remember, this is two orders. Almost there. Salmon is good. Remember, it's on low. All right. So let's start adding the rice. The rice is already nice and hot, as you can see from the steam. So I don't gotta do a lot. That's one. That's two. Make sure I have enough. Two and a half. Okay. There we go. And now, all we're going to do is saute up the rice with the chicken. All those flavors are going to get nice and, you know, sexy. It's all about the sexiness. I don't care what nobody says. Not sexy, it's not right. All right, the rice has been cooked with a little oil, with a, with a little bit of oil and salt. You need to know how to do the rice. I have a video on my channel. So right now, re-seasoning everything. So back with the pepper. I do spicy things, I do flavorful things. Nothing bland over it. So boom. Just get that. And remember, the rice is already hot. So now the onions and the garlic and everything are getting nice and they're getting together. They're doing what they're doing. Making that love. And it's already got a little color, but that's not how I get my color. So I'm going to show you how I get my color, which is some good old-fashioned paprika. Paprika. I'm going to be sprig it on there. Don't be, don't be shy. All right, so we got the paprika. Maybe like a tablespoon if you want a measurement. And all you do is just get that nice. Make sure your flame is in between low and medium. But with this pan, you really don't have to worry about that. Right? And just make sure everything is nice and it has that color. See that? Getting nice and sexy. Everything is in there. 
nice, nice, nice. Now all we're doing is getting everything one color. Just keep tossing it. Nice. Very nice. Turn it down low. Now you can add more, which I'm going to because I want a deeper color. Spanish rice usually has a nice deeper color. You also want to cook out the paprika. You don't want to taste like the grain, the graininess of the spice itself. So another maybe half a tablespoon and we're just going to toss that in and the rice is done. The rice is done. And you can't tell me this doesn't look like uh, arroz con pollo. I just showed you a giant shortcut how to do it. So. Toss, 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 and you're good. You are very good. I'm gonna turn off the salmon, which I'm doing right now. Got rice all over my stove, but it's all good. I clean up later, and boom, there you go. You got the arroz con pollo. Just like that. See? Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now I'm gonna show you. So, container. All right? I'm gonna show you that salmon too. So let me, here's the salmon, and let me take off the cover. Look at that. Look at those two beautiful pieces of salmon. See? And that was just, you sear it on top, you flip it over, you turn it down after a little, and that's it, it's done. Very easy to do. Very, very easy to do. All right, so now you get your spoon, right? Make sure your stove is off. I'm gonna show you one container, all right? So this is what I'm doing. I'm filling this bad boy up right here. Remember, I got two orders. Enough for one, and enough for two, which I do have. See, that's one. I'm gonna show you with the salmon. Take the cover off. And here we go. Get that bad boy right here. And then boom. And there you go. Arroz con pollo with blackened salmon. Mr. Spice Special, welcome to my world. This is what I do. This is uh, my part-time, which is kind of my full-time, even though I have a full-time. But, you know, this is what I enjoy doing the most. Shout out to all of y'all. Uh, I'm gonna make this delivery. Peace and love. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Shout out to Crystal. Shout out to my parents. Shout out to the Swan. Peace and love.